See, third question. Find the LCM and LCM of following integers uh, by applying the prime factorization method. So here the three three numbers are given. So find out the LCM and LCM by using prime factorization method. So first you have to find out the prime factors of given three numbers. See, we have first twelve, two six are twelve, two three are six, three ones three. And next fifteen, three five are fifteen, five ones five. And next to twenty one, three seven are twenty one, seven ones seven. So I write here twelve factors one into two into two into three. That is equal to one power one. Two square into three power one. Next fifteen. Write the factors. One into three into five. That is equal to one power one. Three power one. Five power one. Next twenty one. One into three into seven. So one power one. Three power one into seven power one. So write the HCF. HCF of twelve comma fifteen comma twenty one. That is equal to. See here. Smallest powers are common prime factors. So here the smallest powers are common prime factor is one now and three also. Smallest powers is take this one. So that is equal to one power one one three power one three three. So next LCM LCM of twelve fifteen twenty one that is equal to. So here the greatest powers are prime factors. So here prime factors are two one. Two, three, five, seven. So greatest powers are here: two square, three power one, five power one, seven power one. And then multiply one into two here: two square, four into three into five into seven. Twelve into thirty-five. And then multiply, you will get four twenty. Thirty-five also four twenty. That is LC. Next, see this one. Prime factorization method here here also. So we have first eight two four ja eight two two ja four two ones. Next nine three 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 ja nine three ones. Next twenty five 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 ja twenty five five ones five. And next write here practice eight one into two into two into two. That is equal to one power one. Two u next nine factors one into three into three into three here one into three square next twenty five factors one into five into five one into five square and find out uh, HCF HCF of nine comma eight comma nine comma twenty five that is equal to Smallest powers are common prime factors. The common prime factor is one. Smallest power is one. So that is equal to one. So LCM is equal to LCM of eight, nine, twenty-five. That is equal to greatest powers. Greatest powers and prime factors. Prime factors two, three, five. So one into two into three into five. So right here, greatest powers one. Two cube three square or five square. The right here two cube is eight nine three square nine five square twenty five seventy two into twenty five and then multiply this one we will get eighteen hundred. That is the LCM of the three numbers. See this one. See this one. We have. We have first seventeen. So seventeen prime factors one and itself. These are prime seventeen, twenty three, twenty nine. Those are the prime numbers. So one and itself only. So here one into seventeen and next to twenty three. One into twenty three, twenty nine. One into twenty nine. Okay. So here the HCF is equal to 
ट्वेंटी स्मालेस्ट पवर्स प्राइम फैक्टर्स ओनली वन एंड नेक्स्ट एल सी एम ऑफ सेवेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी नाइन इज ईक्वल टू ग्रेटेस्ट पवर्स प्राइम फैक्टर्स सो दट इज सेवेंटी इंटू ट्वेंटी थ्री इंटू ट्वेंटी नाइन एंड देन मल्टीप्लाई विल गेट दिस वन लेवन थाउजेंड थ्री थ्री हंड्रेड थर्टी नाइन दट इज द एल सी एम ऑफ दी सेवेंटीन ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी नाइन Okay, so this is about the third question. See, next question, fourth one. Given that HCF of two numbers, three hundred six and six hundred fifty seven is nine. Find LCF of three hundred six and six hundred fifty seven. So here HCF of two numbers is given. Find out the LCF of two numbers. See here, first write given. Given that HCF of two numbers, two numbers is equal to nine, and LCM of two numbers is equal to we don't know that you have to let x. Okay, and uh, the two numbers are that is equal to three hundred six comma six hundred six hundred fifty seven. So we know that the formula for relation between LCM and HCF. So product of LCM into HCF is equal to product of two numbers. Product of two numbers. So here LCM. LCM we don't know that take x. HCF. HCF of the number two numbers are nine. That is equal to product of two numbers. Product of two numbers means given two numbers are. Three hundred six into six fifty seven, and find out x is equal to three hundred six into six fifty seven by nine. Three three is nine. Three one three zero. Three two is six. Three one is three. Three three is nine. Three four is twelve. So that is equal to thirty four into six fifty seven. So that is equal to See here, double two, double three here, uh, eight. So twenty-two thousand three hundred thirty-eight. So therefore, LCM of LCM of three zero six six fifty seven is equal to twenty-two thousand three hundred thirty-eight. Okay. So this is about the. Fourth question. See next question. Fifth question. Check whether six power n can be end with the digit zero for any natural number n. So here the six power n can be end with the digit zero for any natural number n. So here the six is the here the composite number. Okay. So it should be at least having three factors we have. So So this is not ends with zero. See here, why? Because if a number ends with the digit zero, it should be. divisible by two and five both. Then only it is possible. See here, if a number ends with zero, it is compulsory. It should be divisible by two and five both. We'll see an example. 
10 here 2 5 yeah, 10 5 1 5 so here the ends with 0 we will get the 2 into 5 so it should be divisible by 2 and 5 compulsory ends with 0 number that is should be divisible by 2 and 5 for suppose take 50 225 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 5 is equal to I write here 2 into 3 whole power n. So here the 2 and 3 are the prime factors of 6. Okay. Here 5 is not a prime factor of 6 power n. So, therefore, 6 power n is not divisible by 5. Okay. So, 6 power n cannot be ends with 0 for any natural number n. Okay. So, this is about the fifth question. See, next question. Sixth one. Explain why 7 into 11 into 30 plus 30 and 7 into 6, 6 into 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 plus 5 are the composite numbers. So, here the given two numbers, these two numbers are composite numbers. Or why? They are asking. See here, first take this number. So, here the given 7 into 11 into 13 plus 13. See here in this number 13 is common. Okay. 7 into 11 plus 1. Here 13 into 7, 11, 77 plus 1. That is equal to 13 into 78. So, what are the factors of 78? 2, 3, the 6, 2, 9, 70. Next to 3 13s. 13 ones. So it's right here. 13 into 2 into 3 into 13. See here the given number. The given number can be written as a product of two numbers except one and itself. So then only it is a composite number. See here, right here. Given number can be written as a product of two numbers, two numbers except one and itself. So, the given number is composite number. Composite. Okay. See. See this number. So, this is first one. This is second one. 7 into 6 into 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 plus 5. So, here the take 5 is common. So, here 5 common. 7 into 6 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 
plus 1 and then simplify this one 5 into I have to multiply this one and plus add 1 we will get 1009 see here this number also I write the uh, given number the product of two numbers except one and itself then only this one or this one also a composite number so therefore the given number here also the given number can be written as a product of two numbers except except one and itself so the given number is composite number composite number okay here the both numbers this number and this numbers are composite numbers why right? because here this is the that number can be written as product of two numbers at least so here the except one and itself then only those two numbers are composite numbers okay so this is about the sixth question